Hello guys, this is George and welcome back to George Basic Script and Finance. In this video tutorial, I will teach you how to enable Bitcoin function on Cash App. First of all, you need to open your app. Then you need to click the bank or home icon in the bottom left menu. And when you scroll down, you will see Bitcoin in this menu. You need to click this. And guys, uh, first of all, to activate your Bitcoin function on your Cash App, you need to uh, go through verification. So you need to go through additional uh, verification steps. Most likely they will ask you your mobile phone number, your driver license or so guys. So first of all, you need to go through verification. When you scroll uh, all the way down, you will see uh, deposit Bitcoin button right here. When you click this, it will automatically ask you to enter your mobile phone number. So you need to enter all of the information you need to go through verification and after that you will be able to use Bitcoin function on Cash App. So after you will do it, you can buy a Bitcoin. Uh, when you come here on this page, on the Bitcoin page, you will see this blue buy Bitcoin button. You need to click it, select the amount and buy Bitcoin on your account, guys. So once you will buy the Bitcoin, you will see your balance on the main page. You will see this um, buttons, buy, sell, and this arrow button. When you click buy, you will buy more Bitcoin. When you click sell, you can exchange uh, your Bitcoin into dollars. And when you click the arrow button, you can send your Bitcoin to another wallet, guys. And also, guys, if you want to receive Bitcoin from any other wallets, you can scroll down you need to click deposit Bitcoin button, get your Bitcoin address. When you click this button, you will get your own Bitcoin address and you can use this address to send Bitcoin from any other exchanges or wallets to your Cash App Bitcoin uh, wallet. So that's all I want to show you. If this video was helpful for you, don't forget to click the like buttons and don't forget to subscribe.